Alright guys, welcome back to Dark Forces. Uh, in this mission, we're headed to the docking port on Ramsey's Heat. Um, when I was younger, like 9 when I played this, um, I always pronounced it Ramsey's Heat, but I think it's actually pronounced Ramsey's Head, whatever. We have to go there and plant a tracking device onto a smuggler ship so we can find out where they are sending the frick. Now the frick, if you remember correctly, was the material that they're making the Dark Trooper armor out of. Phones were turned up way too loud. That almost deafened me. You there. Now in this level, we are also going to um, try and find the weapon that we missed in the previous episode. Um, I'm still kind of bummed about that. Um, if you hear any background noise, on this uh, on this episode, it's because it's currently the afternoon in Southern Arizona, so I have the air conditioner on. Hopefully, the cheap mic I'm using um, isn't picking it up. I'm using a uh, Turtle Beach wireless headset that has a detachable microphone on it. That's why I used to record these videos. So I don't have anything cool like a Yeti or anything like that. It's just a cheap microphone because I'm just doing this for fun. There's a Riyiz. Or a, uh, a Gran. For a second there, I thought he killed himself because it sounded like they played his death noise. Let's try again with the auto gun. I haven't been using the auto gun as much as normal because for some reason I'm having trouble finding um, uh, ammo for it, the power cells or whatever. Alright, let's see here. Need the yellow key. Just like Doom. Whoa, whoa. Oh. It's the Gamorians. Hey, someone did die. I certainly didn't kill him. Okay, so I'm sure you noticed uh, the Gamorians' axes go right through uh, your shield again. If I were using the super shield selection um that still will have damaged me like that um there's a key over there okay see see these white glowing things over here we're gonna make sure no one's around those are the dark forces versions of um doom's green exploding barrels There's another Gran up there. I'm not going to worry about him right now. Yellow key. Ah, the mortar gun. Okay. This is what we missed on the last level. Sometimes boxes are secrets. Sometimes, like, now they're not. Okay, so the mortar gun is basically a grenade launcher. It's another one that I hardly ever use. I use it less than I use the thermal detonators, but you can basically consider it a uh, thermal detonator launcher, except I think that the thermal detonators actually do more damage. Um, where'd that guy go? I was going to show you guys, but I don't, I don't see him anywhere. So we'll go back to the yellow door. I was lucky. I didn't even notice those um, barrels. Uh, barrels, uh, mine. 
the whatever it was down there. I didn't notice it. Okay, so I think I need to bring that that back up so I can continue down the path. Okay, let's see. For some reason I can't get the volume in my headphones right today. Yeah. I hate exploding barrels. I mean, I like them and I hate them. I don't typically enjoy standing right next to them. So when I was younger, we used to always call them uh, Gamoreans because we were pronouncing them Pahoanetically. But I'm fairly certain that it's Gamorian. few levels I really don't like, um, and a lot of them have to do with, like, mazes and stuff like that with this, um, especially with these old graphics, and, um, I know you can't see it on your screen because I have it filling most of the screen, but I'm actually playing this in a window on my computer because I have a 24-inch monitor, and, um, when it's full screen on the 24 inches, because of the old resolution, you can't, it hurts my eyes, like, I can't see anything, but, um, I have 20-20 vision, but, um, I have very sensitive eyes, and so, like, I can't play, I can't play VR games, or anything like that. um, I used to work at Walmart, when I was at Walmart, they had a VR training for, uh, active shooter, and for, um, signage, and, like, I would, after I would do the VR training, it was only like 15 minutes, I would have the worst headache, like I would have a migraine, like a splitting headache for like the next 3-4 days straight, and like I even went to HR and I'm like, look here's the deal, I can't do this, and they were like, oh they're actually playing on moving all of uh, our training to VR, and I'm like, so you have like, no alternative, um, you have like no alternative classes or anything for people who can't do VR like me. And they're like, no, I keep a bottle of uh, etc. migraine in my office though. So before you do a training, just come to my office and I'll give you a, I'll give you a migraine pill. And I'm like, all right, whatever. Big old Walmart. I don't like how low this roof is. Mortars. Uh, see, I thought that those would be like elevators, kind of like how that yellow door was that same um, texture. So I thought that maybe that was, I mean, like how this is an elevator, I thought that maybe that would be an elevator too. I was wrong, so I assume I gotta not do that. I haven't found a single health pack this level. This looks just like the inside of an Imperial prison. Hmm. Stop where you are. interesting how in a galaxy this big 
they only have four different wall types. I don't I don't need that blaster. Or the blaster, the battery. I don't need the battery. It'd be a waste of bullets. So if you've been watching my Doom series, uh, that's running concurrently with this one, you'll know um, very suicidal when it comes to explosives. So that's another reason I don't really care for the, um, I forgot the name of it, the mortar gun. Um, just because it's shooting an explosive and... <laughs> it just bounced me in the air. It didn't even do that much damage. Um, yeah, like, uh, I tend to be suicidal with splash damage. And so, I just, the mortar gun, because of that, was just never a weapon that spoke to me. But I need the blue key. That means we're gonna run back from whence we came. Circle strafe around the corner. I thought I saw a guy there, yep. If I find a good opportunity to use it, I'll show you guys the, uh, the mortar gun, but in my opinion, in most cases, there are better weapons to use in the mortar gun. Well, in, not in, just in most cases. In every case, there's a better weapon to use in the mortar gun. It's a pretty disposable one, kind of like the fusion cutter. Um, finally have a health pack. Um, like in most cases where it would call for an explosive like a mortar, it's usually, in my opinion, better to just lob a thermal detonator at them because I'm pretty sure the thermal detonator does more damage. <laughs> oh, they're all at the urinal. I forgot about that. How did that not kill him? Any of them? Did he even get the grand? It got no one! What the hell? It was like right in front of him. Alright. Oh god, we're... I'm... Red key. I'm just pissed I didn't kill all the people at the urinal with this single thing. Alright, there's obviously people down here, so we're gonna crouch, that's the, that's the mortar launcher. See it took like four shots of splash damage before I even killed the stormtrooper there. Touche. All right then. All right. Red key. Lots of shields. Which in Doom means that you're about to be ambushed. In this one, not so much. I mean, there's someone lobbing thermal thermal detonators at me right there. But oh, I got standing on the thing. Extra life. I'm a weapon supercharged. I don't really want that because I don't really have the ammo for I can't get up there. I don't really have the ammo for it. There's the douche. Oh, he was behind me that whole time. Okay, what's over here then? I had more power cells so I didn't have to use this. Claymores and mortars. Just what I wanted, yeah. 
wonder where that one dude was. Am I full up? I'm full up hungering eggs. There he is. I, now that I don't need the health packs, yeah, I'm full up on grenades. Alright. I could use that shield now, though. I don't even care that Grand can throw those all day. Okay, so at the end of this was the red door? Right, 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 right. Okay. Commandos. Stormtroopers. I like how the commandos are the better enemies, but the stormtroopers are completely covering armor. It doesn't never really made sense to me. Stormtroopers are supposed to be the expendable ones, and the commandos are the more elite ones. And the stormtroopers get the full armor set. Basically, repeating what I just said. You know, whatever. For emphasis. There's the blue key. Like freaking Doom, I had to get all three colors. I like how they're just kind of on display, even though none of the Im none of the Imperials, literally none of the Imperials use thermal detonators, and there's a whole bunch just sitting there on display. All right, whatever. I hate the look on this. Got him. I'm gonna go back and get those now. Even if I never uh -huh. use them. It's nice to know they're there. Do I want to go down here? I honestly don't know. F it. <laughs> it just takes me right back here. Alright. Whatevs. Alright, let's go find that blue door. Find our smuggler ship. Find out where the frick is going. Oh yeah, that was the bathroom. It's the only bathroom in the galaxy, apparently. You there, stop where you are. even remember where the blue door was or what the blue door looked like. I will take the shields though. Are you a blue door? Hey. I mean I'm up to 99. Oh yeah, the blue door was through here. <laughs> Fuck. I'm running too fast. Because you hit this and this was the blue door switch. Stop, Rebel I refuse. Alright, cool. Alright, so the stream decided to stop recording at this moment, um, so I didn't catch the end of the level, but um, it was just right at the end of this hallway right here, so there wasn't really much that we missed, um, and I really didn't feel like replaying the entire 20 minute level just for 
the last 15 seconds but anyways we planted the device on the smuggler ship and now we know where the frick is headed so that will be the next episode all right guys have a good one